I'm about to get real and expose vulnerability, which has been something that I've steadfastly avoided for years. To accept that I am a soul with feelings and emotions that yearns for love, authentic love, love that emanates through your heart that you can feel in your bones, love that you can feel pumping through your veins, lighting up your entire body. In my human experience, I've had multiple events happen in my personal life that have led me to distrust other people and turn off my emotions. I dim my light as a survival mechanism, but in dimming my light, while the negativity is not felt as heavily and hard, neither is the positivity and beauty of life. Living in a state of gray is existing and surviving, but not living a life of color and authenticity. Animals have pure souls that appear to desire two things, survival and love. When you look into the eyes of an animal, you can see and feel their soul. An animal that is hurting because of life circumstances cannot hide their hurt or cast it aside like a human can. You can see the pain in their eyes and feel the loss of spirit, the dimming of their energy. I love and respect animals because they do not have the filter that humans have. They are truth. Beyond survival, Many dogs possess the innocence of babies and their nature is to love unconditionally. If they are not showing unconditional love, it's usually because life failed them in one way or another. The love is there and innate, but clouded by fear. Dogs cannot hide their feelings like humans and you can feel their innocence and yearning to trust even when they are emotionally wounded. At the animal shelter, while in their most vulnerable and often lowest position in life, animals open a door to humans, allowing them into their lives and showing gratitude, even when people are the very reason that they are homeless. Their souls are innately good. I admire their vulnerability. Vulnerability is a character trait that requires strength. The vulnerability and silent strength that dogs possess are an example for humans to follow and show words aren't needed for a life to be of value. Love is all that matters. I admire and respect that the dogs that come in, usually under horrific circumstances, to a small, new living arrangement that can be loud, scary, and smelly, can still find room to trust. Volunteering gives dogs trust and hope. As humans, I've learned that our existence is tied to hope. I put one foot in front of the other, day after day, with faith and hope. Hope for a dog is simple, love. Dogs exist already knowing the core meaning of life beyond survival, to love, to trust, to show vulnerability, to have existential meaning without words, to be the best soul they can be for every connection they have in life. I aspire to be the light in these dogs' darker days, to help bring them back to their truth beyond survival. That's why I volunteer. And sorry, my voice is so annoying, I cannot stand it. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you can volunteer in your local shelter and help dogs.